Hey YouTube, uh, this is David, Richter Scale Studios. Still don't have my voice back, but I just got a package dropped off by UPS. This was an eBay find I got. Uh, what you're looking at is a Badger uh, Millionaire 480-1. Uh, this is an oil compressor, but it's um, only 35 pounds. It's got a big handle, the big casing. Um, it's supposed to be under 30 decibels, which is equivalent to a refrigerator. So um, I just took the bolts off the case. Very simple design. Um, I cannot turn it on yet because uh, it came without oil. I got it from on eBay. It was from a um, excuse me, a uh, pawn shop out of the Midwest. I have it in my kitchen because I was uh, wiping it down and uh, checking over it and making sure all the parts are on it, which looks great. And uh, one thing I wanted to share this with: uh, this has been discontinued by Badger, but um, if you can find one. And if someone's willing to get rid of these cheap because um, you know they're discontinued, grab it. They're still being made by a company in Italy called Werther International. Here's the name right here. I'll just put it up. And um, they have a company. They market under Silent Air, which if most of you guys in the uh, painting community that use airbrushes have heard of Silent Air compressors. And uh, <clears throat> they have the 20. Um, 20-A, the Silent Air 20-A is their model, and I'll show you um, what I just downloaded. Uh, when I bought this, it didn't come with anything. Just there, I uh, came with a, a little air compressor hose, I mean an airbrush hose, and whoever had this before added on this anodized piece of the splitter, which is kind of a nice little touch, and with the two valves. <clears throat> I was able to go online and download the instructions and care manuals. Um, just uh, searched the model number, the Badger 480A, and there's the picture of it right there. It's got everything in there. Uh, tells you how to fill the oil, how much oil it needs, and all that. Then also, I did, when I did the other research about getting parts for it, in case anything goes wrong with it, or for the oil, which you could probably use as regular compressor oil, but I wanted to play it safe, I got a hold of Silent Air. Uh, I got the uh, bottle of oil, it was like 25 bucks or something like that. And you can see here, this is the Silent Air 20A. Basically looks like the same compressor, which it is. So, and uh, they're out of Houston, Texas. I'll put their website uh, number right here, letter, or their website address. Um, if those of you, even if you have one of those compressors or one of the other uh, um, silent badgers that are oil ones, uh, they look like they're great compressors, especially the oil. I know there's a little more maintenance to them, but uh, they're more worthwhile, I, I think, with the silence of them. And, uh, <clears throat> Uh, the people at Silent Air grab the phone right away, are really helpful. Uh, explain to me, yeah, they used to make those uh, for Badger. They still make the basic compressor, but not for Badger anymore. So uh, that's just a little update I wanted to do, what's going on. I'm going to come back with some other uh, videos very soon because I haven't put on one up in about a week or so. But um, I'm kind of excited to get this going, and I'm doing a uh, Caleb Wissenbeck um, airbrush class in Sacramento on Sunday. So I'll have the oil by then. I got my uh, new Badger hoses to hook up my uh, airbrushes to it. And this will be something really easy to throw in the truck and uh, carry with you that big handle. So uh, it weighs about 37 pounds, so it'll weigh around up to 40 pounds, but gives you a good workout carry from the parking lot into the game store. And it, also being quiet, it's gonna be uh, a nice thing too. So uh, that's gonna be it for this video and uh, as usual, thank you for joining me. Um, sorry you're in my kitchen, but uh, I wanted someplace close where I can get to water and cleaning products, wipe this down and get uh, inspect it. So um, I will do a follow-up video in the near future when this is running and show you a little test run on it. And hopefully it works. And I paid 120 bucks for it. Um, what they were selling for was in the high fives, which is expensive for a compressor. And um, I believe uh, Chicago Airbrush Supply sells the Silent Airs, and they're like in the 540 range, uh, originally 900. So that's you know uh, getting a good discount. And a lot of those places, you know, obviously those uh, online companies are uh, you know able to discount their products without the brick and mortar store. So uh, that will be it for now. Thank you for joining me, and we'll see you in the next video.